This is Lake Michigan. I'm down on the beach at a historic town called Glen Haven. They have, you know, it's a replicated village. They have all of these little buildings, you know, like a, a smithy and and there is a an old US Coast Guard station. It had been originally located all the way down over there on the point, but it was being buried by sands. So they moved it over here. It's not active anymore. The US Maritime Coast Guard Life Saving Station now is located down that away. So the islands that you see in the distance with all of the trees, they, yesterday we were farther down and you could just see them really far in the distance. These are the Manitou Islands. That's north and that's south Manitou. They say it's beautiful. They have a ferry. I think it takes four hours to get over there and it's a day use area and backpacking. This is the beach. Look at the water. I swear it looks tropical here. They said for the first time in a long, long time that Lake Michigan and Lake Huron are cleaner than Lake Superior. And that's because of the invasive zebra mussels, which has really helped the water, but they say it's really decimating the fishing industry here. This water is, oh, just gorgeous. I did put my hand in and it's also freezing, freezing cold. But you can see the different, I hope you can see the different shades of blue in the video. I don't know if you can, but oh, it's just, just beautiful. We're doing it separately because this is one of the few areas really around here that you can't bring a dog. Now there's nobody around and it's closed, but I'm not comfortable doing it because there's really quite a few people. It doesn't look like much now, but kind of coming in and out and I don't want there to be a problem. The sand here on the beach is that really fine sand like you see on Long Island. Really beautiful white. I'm so continental today. This family walked down speaking French and when they passed me they smiled. I said bonjour. The signs say 50 ships have wrecked across the shoals here in this little stretch that's called the Manitou Straits.